Welcome Focus Fanatics. In this video I'll be discussing the three delay print commands. The first command is our standard delay print. This command is used when the order needs to be sent to the kitchen sometime in the future rather than immediately. Locations that have a lot of phone in orders and to go orders will really benefit from the delay print command. Second option is the delay print modify time command that may be used to change the time that the order will print to the kitchen. So basically what that means is if the delay print command is used and the customer calls back and changes the time he's going to pick up the order, that's when we will use the delay print modify time command. The third option is called delay print cancel order and is used to cancel the entire order to the kitchen altogether. So if the customer calls back and says, hey, you know what, go ahead and cancel that order. I'm not going to be able to pick it up. I'm not going to be able to make it. We can now cancel the order to, from prevent the order from being printed to the kitchen. That way there's no food loss. Okay, so let's just jump right in and take a sample phone order and watch the delay print commands in action. So say customer calls in and orders a taco salad. You want some ranch? So the first thing we're going to do is take his name. Go ahead and just use Matt. And he says, hey, I'm going to pick this up at 11 o'clock. Sure thing. So we will say delay print. And this brings up our delay print, delay print window here. It shows our current time at 940. And it defaults the print time to 940. And we have our AM PM label here. We can simply change the time by clicking AM PM. And or we can print it with our shortcuts over here. If we want to print it in 10 minutes, we can just hit 10 minutes. All right, we also have our hour up, down, our minute up and minute down options that will they do just what it sounds like it's going to do. Hour up is going to change it an hour up. Hour down is going to be an hour down. Same with minute up and minute down. So for a sample phone order, the guy was wanting to pick it up at 11 o'clock. We know it takes our kitchen about 10 minutes to prepare the food. So we'll want it to print to the kitchen at 10.50. So we'll go ahead and just manually put our time in here at 10.50 p.m. And hit OK. So order is submitted, but it has not printed to the kitchen. So at 10.50, the order will automatically print to the kitchen printer so the cooks can start preparing the food. That way it will stay hot and fresh when a customer comes to pick it up. Now let's say the customer calls back and says, hey man, I'm running late. I'm not going to be able to pick up my order until 11.30. Sure, no problem. Let me fix you up. So you will recall the check. And then that's when we're going to use our delay print modify time command. So it was going to print at 10.50, but since he can't get there until 11.30, and it takes, don't, don't forget, it takes 10 minutes to print, prepare in the kitchen. So we'll say print this in the kitchen at 11.20. And we'll hit OK, and it's prompting us to delay the printing of check 65 until 11.20 p.m., See, so, yep, that's perfect. So now it's gone and suspended, and at 11.20 it will print to the kitchen. So let's say the customer calls back yet again and says, you know what, I'm just not going to be able to make it tonight. Can you just cancel my order for me? Say, sure thing. So we'll go ahead and pick up the order. We'll go over here. We have our delay print cancel order command. Click on this, and it's going to prompt us. Cancel printing of check 65, yes. And it just confirms that delay print of check 65 canceled. We'll say OK. OK, now we have successfully canceled the order from printing to the kitchen, but we still need to cancel the customer's order altogether. So don't forget, we will need to void this taco salad. And it's asking us for a access, an access code. And the customer changed his mind. And we have a balance of zero. So we'll go ahead and just tender it out. Well, that's how the delay print commands are used. Let me show you how to how they're set up real quick. 
We'll just go into Focus Setup, go to Order Entry, and then Packages. And our first package we named Delay Print. It's simply a command with the delay print as the item. Our next one is going to be the delay print modify time and that's just command and just like it sounds delay print modify time and lastly is our delay print cancel order command and the item is delay print cancel order so that about wraps it up for our delay print feature hope you guys can utilize this in your establishments and until next time stay focused